You're listening to America Overnight, mystifying the airwaves for more than 29 years. Thank you for staying up with us. Ghosts. We've had many callers over the years tell us of hauntings, voices, and other phantasmagorical phenomena. Today, friend of the show, Dr. Quincy Reagan, tells his story. Quincy. Thanks. This is something I experienced recently while staying at the Chili Pines Motel in Macon for last year's Suspiciacon. I was in room 47. The night manager, an avid listener of the program, insisted I take this particular room. Now, the manager explained that years back, the body of a man was discovered under the bed, inside that wooden border that motel beds tend to have. And the body had been there a week, he said. Guests had stayed there, sleeping with the corpse a foot below him. They only found the body when housekeepers complained about the smell. Hauntings have been reported in room 47 ever since. I happily took the room. I fell asleep pretty quick, checking under the bed first, of course. No ghosts visited me, no chilly spots or flickering lights. But when I woke up, I found myself under the bed. It was dark and stiflingly hot. Luckily, I was able to push the mattress off and crawl out before I suffocated. The night manager was kind enough to find me another room. Oh, there you have it, listeners. What we call ghosts take many forms. Quincy was brave enough to tell his story, and I encourage you to keep calling and writing whenever you encounter something strange, something you can't explain. Maybe you're seeing colors that we have no name for. Maybe your toaster is possessed. Remember, dear listeners, when no one else believes you, we do. America Overnight, we'll be right back. 